Is this uh, Spell Sword Ice Ice? It is! Oh, he's, he's gaining ground. He's up to 251. Uh, sure. So he plays Spell Sword Control. Uh, I played against him twice when he was playing. Uh, or when I was playing Control Mage. So I'm familiar with this guy's deck. The the downside though is that he's playing he's playing spell sword control, so um, this this has the potential to be kind of rough on us. Um They make it too easy. Uh I don't think it goes to hundred percent by any means. Um but you're I think you're definitely in in a good spot after that. There are ill winds this day. I think this is probably all right. Has had enough. Yeah, I mean as long as you can keep adequate pressure, you can completely turn it around with a good burn and pillage. It was just that game we lost, we didn't get soul rest, and we didn't get, like, a good burn and pillage to recover, right? So, that was ultimately it. Because he, he not only had the soul rest, but he got that quality wear bat. So, even if we drew the burn and pillage, I, we didn't crack enough runes, right? So, there's certainly, you know, more variables at play. Oh, even if I... You will die, shake skin. <laughs> this is probably a real waste of Murkwater Witches, but... But whatever. I want to keep that pressure. Because I know what he's playing. That was expected. So it's weird. He plays like Spell Sword Control, but it it might be better described as like uh, top endish mid range. Because he plays. I was just going to say he plays Young Mammoths. He plays uh, the Dragon Tails. Is it worth uh, cliff racing into that to save the rest of my stuff? I feel like it is, right? Just to main, maintain tempo here. Because he does have the full top end suite, right? Like, he's got Mirak, Manacora's, Odaving. I know he's running Dawn's Wrath, which is kind of what I'm racing against at this point. <laughs> do I really want to give him that last rune, or do I just wait? I feel like I just wait, My right? Because I don't want to risk giving him a javelin. He would have broken a rune if he went for the witch. Yeah, that's probably why he... Oh, yeah, that's a problem. But as long as he doesn't get a health potion, I actually think we've got it now, so that's a thing. Um... Alright, so that, that gets rid of those opportunities. I think we'll hold on to the Pyromancer for now. We'll double stack here. He doesn't have Elixir, so he can't go up to Dawn's Wrath. Uh, this makes it so he couldn't Dawn's Wrath even if he wanted to. Um, he's got to play like a big guard guy or something, and then even if he does, we have Tazcad here. So, I would Yeah, right? Face. That's a problem. Oh, I guess it's not. 
Well, there's that guard guy that I was talking about. All right, so no, no health potion, and we're good. There we go. Poor, poor uh, Itchies, Ice Ice. Like I said, I played him, played him twice when I had Control Mage, and we won both of those games. And uh, now once with Archer, but. I'm glad to see he's making the climb too, because he certainly ranked higher than he was the last couple of times I played him.